welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a classic red lip look for Valentine's Day. I kept the eye makeup really, really simple because I wanted the focus to be on the red lip and I love the way that it turned out. This look is very, very simple to do and I really hope you guys enjoy this look. If you wanna see how I got it, just keep on watching. All right, we are going to start off by priming our face and I'm using the NYX Angel Veil. This is the primer that I've been using lately and I really, really love it. To fill in my brows, I'm using a new brow pencil that I just picked up a few days ago. This is the Benefit Precisely My Brow Pencil. I love how fine the actual product is. It gives you a more natural look and I also got it in a lighter shade. I got the number three. The number four is like the perfect match for me, like the perfect in darkness. But the number three is just a little bit lighter and I really like how my brows have been looking. It just looks like your brows are naturally filled in. I'm gonna do a little color correcting now. I love using my NYX Dark Circle Concealer for that. It has like a peachy color. I believe this one is the number three. And I'm also gonna use this to prime my eyes before I do my eye makeup. I just like to blend it all out with my beauty blender or with any brush, really. I'm gonna be using the Huda Beauty Rose Gold Palette and I am gonna keep the eyes pretty simple. I'm gonna use this shade right here. This color is called Sandalwood and I'm gonna use that right in my crease. I'm just gonna go back and forth and blend that all out. Then the second color I'm going to be picking up is called Bay, and it's this really light shade right here. I'm going to use that shade to highlight right underneath my brows, and then I'm going to also like dust it lightly on my lids, and those are the only two eyeshadows we're going to use. And then if you want, you can go back with that same blending brush from before and blend those other shades in a little bit more. I really just love the way this opens up your eyes and makes them look a little bit bigger. You can definitely see a difference with this eye where I applied it versus this one where I have none. I'm gonna move on to foundation and I will be using the IT Cosmetics new foundation. This one is called Confidence in a Compact. I used this shade yesterday and my skin just glowed all day long. So this is actually a solid foundation, but it's infused with a serum, which is what I was most excited about because this winter my skin has been so dry for the first time ever in my life. So I've just been going crazy trying to find products that are gonna make my skin feel really moisturized and that are gonna help me look great when I have foundation on instead of looking like all cakey and like my skin is dry. But I actually like applying it with their brush. This is any cosmetics brush. It's the number 704 and it's the Skin Smoothing Complexion Brush. It's like at a slant, and I have to tell you guys, these are like the softest bristles ever. They have, A Cosmetics has really good brushes. If you open this lid right here, this is where the foundation is, and I literally just pick it up with the brush, and it feels like a lot's not coming off, but there's product on here. And then I just start smoothing it onto my skin. So it's really just a great foundation for your skin. It's kind of like a skincare infused within your makeup. This foundation smells really good too, by the way. Like all their products have like a signature scent and you can definitely smell it in the foundation. So good. What I love about A Cosmetics is that they have found the perfect way of making their products full coverage, but still looking like your skin. That's what I feel like this foundation is doing. My skin just looks like my skin, but it looks flawless. It's like you have a filter on your skin. Moving on to concealer now, I've been using this palette from Graftobian. I got it from this website called Friends or Friends Beauty. I'll get the exact name for you guys, but they sell all types of makeup, like drugstore, high-end, at a discount, and then they gave me an additional discount on top of that. I think it's like 15%, so I'm gonna list it down below for you guys if you wanna shop any of your favorite brands because you can get it a little bit cheaper on that website. I love how they feel on the skin. Thank you. 
I'm gonna be using my Kat Von D translucent setting powder and just applying that everywhere that I applied concealer and I'm gonna let that sit for like about a minute like I'm not gonna let it bake for too long I'm gonna use one of these darker shades to contour. I'm gonna use this shade right here. Let me give you guys a peek. I'm gonna use that shade there. So for my nose contour, I will use a smaller brush and then I'm gonna switch it up to a bigger brush to do the rest of my contour. This next brush I'm using, by the way, is, um, it's an eyeshadow brush actually, but I'm using it to contour, but it's from Drew Barrymore's line called Flower. I believe they sell it at Walmart and I am obsessed with her brushes. And then to blend the contour out, I'm using a brush from Morphe. This is the G1 from the Gunmetal Collection. Next up, I'm just gonna set my contour using this powder. Moving on, I'm going to be applying some blush, and then on top of that, I'm going to highlight. I'm going to finish up the eyes by picking up that same color that I used in my crease, and I'm just going to apply that on my lower lash line. I have to get my lash extensions filled in next week. So that they can go back to looking really full but i honestly love having lash extensions because you wake up and you already kind of look put together the lip products that i'm using today are also new i picked up this one literally today this is from maybelline and it is the shade rich chocolate they have lip liners now which i'm so so excited about oh, that is so so pretty so i got two shades first i got what is the other shade that i got picked up the shade called Magnetic Mauve, which is this pinky color up here. And then this is the one that I'm gonna be using today. It is called Rich Chocolate. And then for lipstick, I'm using one of the new Urban Decay Liquid Lipsticks. I cannot believe they came out with liquid lipsticks. This is the shade 714 and it is like the perfect red. This is so red. This is like the perfect red. so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe it would mean so much to me and i'll see you guys in my next video bye